since I was a kid. Oh yeah. I was big league dream. I was big league dream. For as long as I live. Always. I'm big league dream. I never got to bat in the major leagues. I'd have liked to have that chance just once. To stare down a big league pitcher. Make him think you know something he does. Chance to squint at a sky so blue that it hurts your eyes just to look at. To feel the tingle in your arm as you connect with the ball. To run the bases. Stretch a double into a triple. And flop face first. Wrap your arms around the bag. That's my wish, Rick and Silla. Hey, Merry Christmas, everyone. Thank you so much for tuning into this podcast. This is Big League Dream, the podcast. We got the three brothers on today. Missing dad because we're doing something special. What's going on, Zane? What's up? How you doing? Thanks for joining us. We're recording this super early today. 6.30. Beast Mode never sleeps. <laughs> That's right. Thanks for joining. Zach, well, how's it going over there in North Carolina? Going well, going well. Um, happy holidays, everyone. Happy to be here. Yeah, it's going to be great. So we just wanted to throw this uh, podcast, this episode together for you, Dad, specifically, because you're always doing so many amazing things for us, especially over the holidays. And we have so many great memories as a family, and we're all so thankful for that. So today we decided just to share some of our favorite Christmas memories that we've had as a family together. And uh, yeah, just over the years, we're just so, super appreciative of you. So we just want to share some of our memories. And uh, Zach, what's some of your favorite Christmas memories? Yeah, I mean, so many things come to mind. Um, I, I have a good one when we are really young, Ty, when dad got us the sega genesis do you remember oh yeah oh yeah he didn't tell mom that he was getting it for us (laughs) and uh, (laughs) just goes out and buys a a sega for us um and we we played that all the time all the time but i just remember like the look on mom's face because she had no clue and she was like what (laughs) is that and dad dad is just like (laughs) laughing like yeah (laughs) <laughs> yeah we played that non-stop i remember leaving it on in the basement when we were playing uh i think it was lion king or something because you couldn't save your spot yeah there's so we no, just leave the sega no memory cards yet yeah we just leave the sega on and shut the tv off so so it looked like it was off yeah <laughs> i remember playing yeah, was the charles one. barkley game out in the tent whenever we camp in the backyard oh yeah that was a good one Charles Barkley shut up and jam. <laughs> yeah, that's a, that's a good that's a good memory. Uh, dad Dad always did something like that. Usually, like once a year, it was always something something at the end where it was something special and some sort of surprise. Uh, one I I remember. Well, there's a lot I remember for sure, but one was when he got us all rock band. I, I remember uh, he got like rock band, like all the guitars, the drums, the microphone, the Xbox, and we were so pumped that we played that like all Christmas morning. I remember there was that. that. I remember that because he, he got it like the day before, or, like two days before. Because like <laughs> when he brought it in the house, he was like, nobody look, nobody look. And you just hear like this big box coming in. We're like, what did he get? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and that's like classic. Like, what is he right? doing? <laughs> He um rotted up the until... stairs with a bunch of bombs. <laughs> Classic. Yeah, waits till the very last minute. Yeah, last minute. does majority of the shopping, and then dad's like, Oh, we gotta get something for uh the your mom. We all gotta go get something for mom. And then he's like, Oh, I gotta get something else too for the boys or whatever. And he'll just out of nowhere, yeah, get us get us Bitcoin. Bitcoin. <laughs> oh yeah. 2017 a little bit of bitcoin for each of us that was good there was was there was also the one uh there was the one where he was like all right there's one more we're always like all right there's always one more what is this goes to the garage and gets that little um fake stuffed animal dog and walks backwards pulls up the little phone app of a dog barking (laughs) oh he's gonna be mine (laughs) Oh, yeah. <laughs> that was the one I was going to say. Because we were just going nuts. Oh, he got a dog. He got a dog. Yeah, we got a dog. <laughs> and you just hear the bark, 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 bark. And he just pulls out a little stuffed animal. <laughs> that was mean. That was classic. That was classic. But you remember it. 
how about that's all, Ty, that's all how matters about, ty how about when he pulled the snowboards out do you remember that oh oh yeah i remember that behind the couch yeah he hid the snowboards behind the couch and he was like what's that behind the couch and <laughs> pulls out these huge snowboards <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah i remember that you had that green one that thing was sweet yeah, going down Maranatha Hill, that was fun. Yeah, always a good time. It was always always fun. Glad that we can all be together um, still, you know, growing up, and we're all in different states now, so it's really nice that we can all be together for the holidays again. Yeah, I'm really looking forward to this Christmas coming up and seeing all you guys. But, I mean, aside from the gifts, like, I mean, dad is always so giving all the time so like that he loves that and then all the memories of just being with family like he's always the happiest around christmas time i feel like like he's he gets to see his family and um all of us together like that's what he's about so every time holiday comes around he's he's in his element man he's so pumped up so that's a that's something that i i always remember too yeah, I was going to say my favorite memory was the dog thing. And then on top of it was just being together and like watching a Christmas story or going and looking at the Christmas lights. So that was always my favorite part of Christmas was just being with everyone. Yeah, same. Being being with all you guys, and our family, and we all, you know, we have our traditions, like you said, go to the night lights, Christmas story, and, and you know, wake up. Mom's always got the amazing food. You know, I like that. <laughs> She's always got the breakfast and all the snacks and all those all the desserts, man. So that's that's my favorite part: the food and just being with everyone. Gotta love it. Yeah, I know. Um, my kids are looking forward to it. Even though I don't like snow, I'm hoping for a white Christmas so that they can see snow for the first time. It won't be. It's gonna. It's so hot. It's like 60 degrees yesterday. Yeah, it was really hot yesterday. <laughs> we still got two weeks to go. That stuff comes out of nowhere. True, lake effect. It's true. So maybe we'll get a white Christmas, maybe not. Never know in Michigan. But to wrap up this episode, again, we just want to say thank you, Dad, so much. We love you. And we got one more gift. We're taking a note from you, doing one of your moves. We got one more thing. We got one more person that we want to add on right now. Two-time World Series winner, Johnny Bench. Hello, John. It's Johnny Bench, and ho, 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 Merry Christmas. My three little elves were here trying to help me decide what to do for you. Well, Zach, Ty, and Zane, and they said, you know, we have the greatest day, Dad, and we have absolutely been inspired by him every day. He is so special to us. You drew up, grew up in Comstock, Michigan, and they think you are the terrific. I guess you had to be a Tigers fan. And, uh, of course, Sparky Anderson was there. What a special man he was. And I guess you liked the Big Red Machine, which I appreciate. And I was one of your favorite people. I even liked that even more. But Ty and Zach and Zane, thank you. are just absolutely the greatest. And during these holiday seasons, they want to make sure that you know that you are appreciated. And you are. So, John, have the best of holidays. Merry Christmas, my friend. 